This could be our last goodbye, our last goodbye, she never told me why. This could be our last goodbye, oh why won't we meet again? We watched her breathing through the night, through the night with a candle burning bright. She couldn't get to sleep that night, she won't have that problem anymore. My bathroom looks like a crime scene now, blood on the floor and the walls in the loo. Let's hope they never find her body or I'll be a dead woman too. I ain't her to you, right? To a golem I have created. A golem? Who's going into it? Her soul is. That's how she stays immortal. Wait a minute. You want me to make her a slave to the golem? To herself? That doesn't make any sense. By Corey Sue's standards, though, Oleander would be considered an evil genius. She's really just a 13-year-old with a grudge against Elibrius. No, her soul will be in the golem, and the slavery spell will be cast on it. Mm. It seems your spell doesn't focus on the soul. My slavery spells are of the aphrodisiac variety, most of them, but I don't understand what you mean. As long as her soul is in the golem, that is her true body. Why would I be able to? Well, all of it. We don't have enough in common to share everything. So where does slavery come in? I want her to suffer. I get that. But where does slavery come in? She'd be enslaved to her own body. Most of us are anyway. No. She would be enslaved to me. She would have to do what I tell her. No, you could have said that before and made it easier. Forgive me. I am used to dealing with soul magic. And talking only to yourself. said I wanted to do this for fun and games, but also, well, I don't usually do things without a price. And your price would be? You thought you didn't waste your... What's that? some time now. As long as you don't break him. <sighs> Too badly. Once again, shouldn't that be up to you, Soji himself? DING DONG! I'll have to talk to Grace about it. She likes stirring her boy toys till they dry. Now, now. Don't tell him all my secrets. Please. I need him alive as well. His blood has something I need in it. It's not his blood she takes. And if we do count donors? Donating sperm qualifies as weird, but all right. Ah, 
How much did you get paid for that? How good is good? Yes. But I need him alive. Dead blood does me no good. Obviously, everyone knows that. Did it look more convincing than the sweet and sour sauce most movie sets use? What's in his blood that's so important? I thought he was human. Ew, gross! He is. Mostly. Mostly. Yes, but I can't say too much now. I can't take that risk. Like, I know you probably don't trust us. You don't even, like, totally know us, but I'm good at keeping secrets. Glad you see my point. I'd even be willing to play double agent. I'd feed your sister any information you want me to. Sure! Information! That's what we're calling it! No, thank you. That ended terribly when I used fall. OMG, I'm not Vaughn. No, but he lost me the other one I needed. And Peppercorn promised him to me. Pep? There's a name I haven't heard in years. How is she? Oh god, I miss her. So you know her then? She was supposed to give me the child of Mahane. I heard of her. I mean, I didn't know her personally. She had the real rap. I know. She was supposed to break the boy for me, so he would be easier to control. Then, after, I would take his child, and she should have him back. She reneged? No. She lost him to my stupid sister. That was careless. She was like my idol. I find that improbable since the Hart family and the Moonrose family are rivals. Yes. But I also need one other's blood to complete what I need. Holy shit, really? I was not expecting that. I mean, uh, called it! You searches. He is only one of the ones I need, along with the child of Mahane. You searchy and Caleb and others. Sounds real complicated. But, no, I mean, Yusagi's mother is... holy. Yes. Luckily, I found out that Yusagi has elfin blood in him. And of course, there is the child. Elfin. Yes. 
Did you not know? I'm willing to bet she just knows how unlikely that is, but is going to play along for the fuck of it. My cousin did say she was part elf. If one of her aunts was, then... Yes, but his is special. His is High Moon Elf. Dude, High Moon Elf doesn't even exist in D&D. Maybe that the Forgotten Realms Moon Elves are Neferbelly's wheat. Oriana Starling was an elf horse kiad. Please note, kiads are explained in Team Falcon's character's backstory, which we'll get into more at the end of the year. What's year, 2020? This is taking forever. Dude, shut your hush. It's not like this is a well-paying 9 to 5 gig. One of her daughters, either Nuni or Donia. Those are terrible names. The ability to take Equin form skipped a generation, leaving one of them with DNA that was PC at best. Remember, kids, Celestia is composed entirely of fuck you science. But I can't remember which quadruplet it was. It would have to be Nuni or Donya. Because they were the only blondes? No. Usagi was human. However, his bloodline is nearly as old as mine. I was careless when I lost his parents and they died a bit too soon. His mother's alive actually. She's been to visit him at the orphanage then to visit him at the palace. That isn't his mother. Bullshit level, DEFCON 5! Like one of your agents? I'm so jealous! Laying it on a bit thick, aren't you? Of course. I couldn't let him get away. OMG, will you please tell me her name? Ooh, his mother's. Like I remember, I gave her several pounds of gold and left it at that. No! The agent! The woman who visited him, you fucking dunce! Like I said, I didn't care to learn it. I just wanted the boy. Can you tell me what she looked like? Like I said, you know what? Tell my sister it was a nice try, but it failed. Dude, I know Berylite is obnoxious, but it's not her fault you're exceptionally unobservant. Rage quit! Dum da dum dum da da dum. New girl Raya, perfect line delivery. But everybody needs to tone it down. Sir Lena, especially. Sir Lena needs to tone it down. Hey, fuck you! I don't want to tone it down. No, no, fuck you! I will never tone it down! This is why you need to tone it down. Fuck off. This is why you need to tone it down. Fuck off. No one will take you seriously if you just act like the class clown. You're one to fucking talk. Blah, blah, something, something, cock. Ari's actor gotta cut off. Uh, uh, Ari's actor gotta cut off. Ray is laughing. That wasn't very musical, but we'll keep it because fuck you. I don't know. Are we done? Yeah. 
Okay, should I hit stop? La 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 la